Greetings, welcome to another Deckard Games YouTube thing. Uh, and today we have another Let's Play kind of thing because, well, we are going to try this game right here Beyond a uh, Steel Sky, the sequel to the classic Beneath uh, Steel Sky. So uh, here we have our main menu, let's not uh, waste any more time. Great music, by the way. Let's dive into a new game. I'd already decided it was going to be my last Let's night shut up and listen. Village. I was sorry to be leaving, but I was restless again. Beware! The day grows dark, and demons stalk the gap by night. Harsh old woman, stop your superstitious nonsense. Besides, this is the best time of day for fishing, eh, Marlo? Yes, Dad. Look, Foster, I use these broken sensors to make a fish alarm. Ooh. It detects the fish before Fish it alarm. Nice work, That's kind of Milo. cheating. Milo was just like me as a boy. And the tech skills I'd taught him would help the village after I left. Do you really have to go, Foster? How can we ever pay you back for all you've done? It's been my pleasure, Max. One of Anita's pies will be payment enough. I owed the Gap folk so much. My first tribe fostered me when I was orphaned all those years ago. They taught me how to recycle tech scavenged from city dumps. Soon, I even built myself a playmate. You have a cool intro. I'm your friend. A very Call cool Joe. revolution no. intro. Joey and I were Reminisce of games like Broken like Sword and whatnot. I upgraded him. He became the best friend I ever had. But then... Foster! Foster, wake up! The sensors detect a fish! It's a big one! What the...? It was no fish. Max, keep back! Marlo! I'm gonna beat you with my share. Dad! Foster! Help me! Help me! Milo had gone. They took the kid. The machine, too. But its riders had left something behind. Max? Milo? That's a nice, nice t shirt. What's happened, Foster? Where's my son? Max? Max? I have a t-shirt with a teddy bear. I told them. I told them there were demons stalking the, the dark. demons. The demons are stalking the clock. The that attacked us was a machine, not a demon. Please, Foster, I don't understand. What... What happened? I told Anita everything I could, though I knew very little. You know nothing, Foster. Max was barely conscious. I could only hope that with Anita's loving care, he would recover. As for me, I had to follow Milo and his captors. Let's go get Milo. I'll bring Milo home, Anita. I promise. Thank you, Foster. I know you will. Dawn was breaking as I left the village. The featureless wastes of the gap stretched away from me. Night followed day, then day dawned once more. Time lost meaning as the tracks beckoned me. Well, luckily forward. the machine leaves. Uh, Determination had long replaced sadness. A uh, trace of took, uh, footsteps that are find, Milo. very traceable. The tracks were barely visible. Barely now, visible. Blurred by the wind. Oh, okay. But I was sure I'd reach their destination soon. Sure. Then I saw the thing I feared the most approaching. Sandstorm. Ah. A battled A storm of sand. But now could only guess that my direction was correct. I decided to save my energy and sank into an exhausted sleep. Maybe the old woman was right. Maybe demons did stalk the gap. 
for as it shrieked and thundered around me, the storm brought back my nightmare once more. Union City security was attacking. As my tribe screamed in terror, I salvaged Joey's motherboard. Taken captive, I couldn't save my village. But I survived when the security copter crashed, entering Union City. On the run, I soon got Joey working. Upgraded yet again, he helped me overthrow the evil that ran the city. As I left, I told him to make the citizens happy. Union City was no place for me. I wanted to be where I could do most good, helping the scattered people of the Gap. Sure. I woke to find the storm had passed. Let's go, dude. Get up. But not without finishing its cruel work. The tracks oh, were no. gone. I was lost. Gone were the so tracks. Was Milo. Then I heard them. Gang gang birds. Gang gang. Scavengers. And in this wasteland, that meant only one thing people. All right. Let's go. Can we go? Can we please go? sure that if I could find where the stalker had gone, I would find Milo. Then, in the distance, I saw a girl crouching over a body. So, use WASD and mouse to look around. Shift to run. So is this in a third-person perspective? Yeah. The girl was holding a device to the lifeless hand. Hey, what is that? Me. Is that a lightsaber? Who the hell are you? I'm searching for a vehicle that... Ah, no! Damn birds! Wait, I just... Whatever that device was, the bird had Hello it now. now. Examine that body. Propped against a rock. Gang gang birds were eyeing up the corpse hungrily. So? No way I was going to get between those birds and their Let's feet. Kick the birds. It, seriously. Hmm. A corpse. Like, probably yeah, I know it is a corpse. So, uh, yeah. So. When an object regularly solid, click the left button, call up interactive menu, use the mouse cursor to unlight the an option, okay. Hmm. Yeah, but how do, how do I switch? No, look at the look at the birds. Short on food, but maybe I had something in my bag I could spare. Look at the freaking birds. Oh, for the love of God. Hmm. Inventory. Kick him. Oh, kill him. Kill him with the crowbar. Crap, dude! Swing that, swing that crap. There were a few things that would scare gang gangs, and a crowbar was not. Yeah, one. not a crowbar, not a, not a swing of a crowbar like solution. that. I wondered if a needle's pie would draw them away. Yeah. 
All right, you senpai. Examine that body. The girl had been doing something to the guy's hand. I wondered what. He'd clearly been dead for days. The logo. I'd seen it before. On the androids that had taken Milo. Hmm. The girl was my only lead. I had to follow her. Follow the girl. Back at Union City. Over the years, I'd heard rumors of how the city had thrived since I'd left Joey in charge. I was finally going to see for myself. Well, doesn't look that good. Let's make a run for it. Well, Mouse isn't doing anything. That is happening. The mouse isn't moving. Just a gap lander. Um, well, hi. Thank you. And you are? Community welfare droid to see you. At your droid service. to see you. To okay. commence your Union City registration, please make your way to the immigration terminal. That's okay. I'm not here to register. I'm looking for. If you're looking for the immigration terminal, it's right over there. Thank you. I'm looking for a. Uh, the vehicle? I'm looking for a vehicle oh. that maybe came this way. A vehicle? Well, this is a freight entrance. So, you're in the right oh, place. Oh, nice. Right. I need to find a boy called Milo. He was... What you need to find is the immigration terminal. It's right over there. Mm-hmm. Can you help me find a missing kid? You want to file a missing persons report? Go register. So how do I register? Easy. Just go to the immigration terminal and you'll get a U-chip for Ooh. your temporary ID. Get the U-chip. The correct route is indicated by these signs. Follow the hand. Sounds easy. Sure. It is. Without it, you won't be able to interact with any of the Minos devices in this area. Sure, dude. Bye. Bye for now. Pleasure. How can I be of assistance? <laughs> so there's the... Yeah, my, my mouse isn't doing anything. What the crap? What the hell is going on? Use mouse to look around. Yeah. Uh, I'm moving my mouse. And it's not doing anything. So yeah, let's follow the the freaking hands. Hand de hand device, okay. I guess this was the immigration term. Okay. Let's use it. Where are you going? Welcome to the Union City Registration Terminal. Please place your hand below to receive your U-chip implant. U-chip implant successful. You are now registered with Union City. A U-chip had been implanted <laughs> into the palm of my hand. Oh, nice. I wasn't sure how it was going to help me. Let's go.
What can we do now? Sure, let's repair this, why not? I called upon my extensive background in engineering. <coughs> yeah. Check it until it works. Why? It's working. Hey, we You're welcome, it. mate. Yeah, piece of cake. Dude, council sure is shining in my direction today. Do you know how many times I've scanned this thing? The last scan must have done the trick. You see, I'm the diagnostician and tech expert around All here. All right. Name's you look like a nice, a nice technician. Have you seen the stalker? I'm looking for a vehicle that might have passed this way. What kind of vehicle? Maybe I can help. Well, I didn't get a good look, but I know it has four giant legs. Legs? <laughs> Word to the wise man. Vehicles have wheels. Brilliant. Not this one. It walked on the sand. And it was, um, shaped like a dog. Whoa. That doesn't sound like any vehicle I've ever heard of. Me neither. And I've got more magazines under my bed than you can even imagine. About this missing kid. Dude, word of advice, huh? Since you're new here? Okay. Look, maybe kidnapping is the sort of thing you people do in the gap. But this is Union City, man. We're a proper society. Sure. Gotcha. Thanks. So... So what's your deal, Hobbsworth? I am a diagnostician for the Ministry of Comfort. for the Ministry of Comfort. And what exactly does a diagnostician do? That's quite the title. I find problems. And fix them? Uh, no, I just diagnose them. Minos fixes them. Okay. Tell me about Joey. Praise Joey. Not a day goes by where I don't thank him for the happiness and prosperity he brought to Union City. Joey and I go way back. We must be talking about the same one. Well, it depends. Our Joey was kind, benevolent, generous, firm, resolute, moral, That's a lot of adjectives. magnanimous, proactive, and a friend to all citizens alike. Does that sound like your Joey? Hmm. My Joey was more of a sarcastic pain in the... But he was my best friend. Sure. Bye-bye. See you around, Hobsworth. Oh, before I forget, I really appreciate your patience back there when I was fixing the bridge. Let me thank you properly. Give me your hand. Uh, okay. There you go. Your kudos just got a boost. My what? Thanks, I think. Keep a smile on your face. Again, what? Why is the freaking mouse not moving? Seriously? Well, this makes it hard to play. Works on the menu. Hmm. That's weird. Nope. Nothing. Super weird. There was a strange smell, and it was coming from the truck. Hmm. Yeah, I know you're not gonna do anything with the crowbar. Ah. Get up. Resume. So let's get away. Hmm. So here we have a trucker. Sir, excuse me, sir. Are you? Whatever you're selling, I am buying. No, no, I'm not selling any. 
A likely story. Name's Wendell. Joe Wendell. Nice to meet you. That <laughs> remains to be seen. <laughs> I don't want to alarm you, but there's a strange odor wafting from the back of your truck. I don't smell out. Really? Because it's like... Except the splendid scent of tasty mini K's. The finest organic knack verse the Gap has to offer. Don't believe me. Gap is a mini Look at those gang gangs. They love my knack verse. <laughs> Can't chase them away. So, your truck is full of mini knockwurst? You betcha. Mini K, best in the gap. Even contains some real mm, meat. Some real meat. You're welcome to take it on, full. Back of the truck's open, although the doors like to play silly beggars. Oh? Requires a special technique. Ritual, you could call it. Ritual? Aye. Now listen carefully. Hi, Step mighty one, pirate. Give the bumper a wallop. Step two, do a little jig. Step three, pull the door and jerk it hard. Wallop, jig, pull. That it? That's it, lad. And remember the order. Sure. I'll leave you be. I'm fine with that. Those birds weren't going to let me anywhere near the back of the truck. Hmm. Didn't rate my chances against all of those razor sharp beaks. Seriously, you pussy. Hey, kid. Hey, weird guy. <coughs> my name's not weird. Yes, it is. I'm Pixel. It's easy to remember oh, because it rhymes with pickle. So it does. I'm Foster. I'll remember that easy because your name rhymes with fossil and you're old. Thanks, kid. You're a very nice kid. What's your story, Pixel? Well, I'm eight years old and my birthday is in only 64 uh, wasn't days. That the girl passing I'm really in good the at background. math and I can even lift my sister. And she's super fat. <laughs> Very comprehensive. Yep. Very comprehensive. Anything okay. I can help you with today? What's wrong with the roundabout? It sucks. Stupid Mr. Hobsworth put a chain on it. The roundabout he said it was for sucks. Safety. Then he dropped the chain on his foot. <laughs> Have you seen a vehicle? Did a vehicle come through here recently? Maybe. How recently is recently? Very recently. Like two nights ago? Oh, then definitely no. But wait, two nights ago, my brother Voxel, he saw this giant monster. What kind of monster? Hmm. Like a totally huge, but not real one. Huge, totally huge, but not real. But not real. I mean, Voxel says it's totally. We're gonna huge, make it, people. And Ember says it's not real. Well, which is it? I don't know what to believe. What's this about a giant monster? Right. So my brother Voxel, like. And we had been playing this massive game of buzzsaws and dynamos. Buzzsaws so and like, dynamos. But, uh. The giant monster. Oh, yeah, right. So, later that night, he wakes me up screaming about how he saw. And? That's the end of my story. Don't tell Ember I told you. Hmm. Who's Voxel? My brother, remember? Where well, can I, I find him? him? I guess. But he's not as friendly or helpful as me. Real question is, will he talk to you? He's been hiding for like two days now. Won't speak to nobody but me. Can you tell me where to find him? Maybe he'll talk to me. Nuh uh. You gotta earn that information. Yeah. I don't know if I can trust you right now. I'm looking for a boy about your age named Milo, who may have come through here. You're asking the right guy. I remember every face that's come through here since I was a little kid. Yeah? How many's that? Like, at least 12. <coughs> How recently did you talking? At least. Sometime over the past couple of nights. Oh, didn't know. Haven't seen no kids. See you around. Call it if you need anything.
I recognized the girl. She was the one who'd run away from yes, me. Yes, she anyway. is. Excuse me. Hello? You! Me what? You're the guy in the desert. And you're the girl with the corpse. Okay, first of all, that guy was dead long before I got there. And second of all, it's your fault Big Steve stole my deed. Lost your what? To who? Do you realize how much potential trade you cost me? Honestly, I have no idea what you're talking about. Ugh. I trade. I'm a trader. Name's Ember. Hmm. What were you doing out there in the desert with that corpse? Mister, are you looking to trade something or what? Trade? Trade, you know, tech, gadgets, I have a finger. From the gap or the you want city. a finger? That's what I do. I collect stuff, I'll give you the stuff, finger. Trade stuff. Only, since you're interfering, let Big Steve fly off with my deed, it'll be a while before I can make proper trades again. Now, excuse me. What's a deed? My deed, man. DTT. Data transfer tool. Deet. What's the deed for? Duh, transferring data. Duh. That's what I was doing with that dead fella. Transferring his citizen ID for trading, yeah? You distracted me and Big Steve nabbed it and flew off. Like I said, thanks. I just need to know if you've seen a missing kid come this way. You're looking in the wrong place. Only boys around here are Pixel and Voxel. And the only thing they're missing is a few screws. Who's Big Steve? You see all these birds all over the place? Big Steve's the purple one, with a beak full of my deet. Hmm. Tell me about this deet. Simple. I collect IDs and I use the deet to swap them. At least I did, until Big Steve grabbed it. How do we get another deet? Ugh, can't. If you're planning to get into the city today, tough. What do you trade? Like I said, some time. Second one doesn't happen very often, but it happens. Suppose a guy from outside wanted to get. Ah, my most popular item. Until Big Steve took my date, that is. Did you see a strange vehicle come through this way? Strange? You mean like that stinky one there? No, this one had legs. Not yeah, you're gonna, you're like gonna stop telling people that you Maybe saw a vehicle with legs. That looks like a dog. I'm not crazy. Yes, you sure are. You're not. What were you doing out there in the desert? Only now, Big Steve has my date and, ipso facto, the ID. What's a U chip? It holds your identity, yeah? All your messages and likes and favorites and that. Everyone from the city has one. Mm. So, you want something or you want to get inside your house. It's basically you your cell phone. Work? And it just happens. Social media. That's all for now. Thanks. Anytime. Oh wait, no. Come back if you want to talk business. For someone with a business interest in dead bodies, she seemed pretty normal. A makeshift workbench had been set up. Its structural integrity seemed over-reliant on some old deflated tires. A makeshift workbench had been set up. Its structural integrity seemed over yes, I want to use it. Old deflated tires. The gang gangs look mean and ugly. a garish big clown can of soda labeled spankles you are currently apologies but you have exceeded your spankles allowance the one can a day limit didn't exactly support a thirst for spankles
myself of the collective noun, a murder of gang gangs. Supreme. Ah. was already active. The hologram showed a young woman in uniform. Sorry to keep you waiting, sir. Welcome to Union City. Thank you very much. My name is Greta. It is my duty and pleasure to answer any questions you may have about Union City and the local area. How may I help you today? So is Joey still running things around here? He was, until just a... That does... Not at all, sir. Joey the same... Good to hear. Oh, we're all friends of Joey, sir. Gone, but... This YouTube... It allows you to interact with all the... As well as story... Sounds good. Yeah, yeah. We prefer the word transformative, sir. The child. From your vi... Was the child a register... No, his... Polite apology... Uh... And isn't hope a wonderful thing? In the meantime, do you have... I'm looking for... No. You haven't seen... Polite. But this V... Is there anything else mm. I can help you with today? Have a nice day. In Union City, sir. It was a tire or modern art. I couldn't tell which. Look at the chain. Seriously. A sturdy chain tethered the roundabout to the ground. Mm. For the love of God, look at the freaking chain. Grab its independent traders. I bought from sketchier places out in the gap. Well, controls suck. Don't know why I can't use my mouse, but uh, whatever. And now it's not doing anything. Yeah, use that crowbar. things to do push me yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
If you had enough. Hey, got a moment? Wanna push me on the swings? Maybe later. Uh... What's wrong with Vok? Like, why is he hiding? Yeah. I told you, man. Will you tell me where your brother is hiding? Maybe we can help each other out. Maybe. Yeah, okay. You've done me a yeah, favor. Yeah, tell me. He's hiding in a bench in the garden. I told him I wouldn't tell no one, but you seem okay. Listen, about... Jeez, man. Why are you so obsessed with monsters? They're not real. So he's hiding in a bench uh, in the garden. This garden? Or the other garden? Or is he hiding in the... In the truck assistance? tire bench thing? Yes, he is. Voxel was hiding out in the makeshift den. Hello, Voxel. Shh. What? My name is Foster. I've just got a few questions. <clears throat> I wanted to ask you if you've seen any monsters. <laughs> How do you know about the monster? Hmm. Your brother, Pixel. Stupid, stupid Pixel. He's so stupid. Go away. Me again. Can we talk some more? Hi. Voxel, about... Truth is, I think he came through here. And I'm looking for someone brave enough to see it and lived... I saw it. Can you describe it? It was big and beasty, and it eats children, and I could hear the screaming, and it was fast and dark and silent. Slow down, one thing at a time. It was big. Like a giant dog. A giant dog? That sounds like what I'm after. Mm -hmm. Did you see any children? No, but I heard them. I heard kids crying inside its tummy and where did it go it sneaked off into the city after that i got in here no way am i gonna let it get me you've been in here for two days still alive aren't i did you say you heard kids crying from inside the dog i think so sure sounded like that can you tell me more about these only that I heard them inside the monster. This giant dog. I was playing buzz saws and dynamos with picks. Then, in the night, I woke up. It was total, like feet padding along the road. I ran over here and hit in my foot. And you've been in here ever since? Yeah. I'm hungry. Any ideas on... People go in and out of the main gate. Are you gonna go in there and kill it? Sure am. That's what monster hunters do best. Oh, I'm a monster hunter now. Then I'm gonna bring Milo and the... You will? Oh, you better take this. Thanks. What is it? A firecracker. Ooh. But you can have it. Maybe I can scare the... I can scare the birds away. Did anyone else see the... Uh, no one but... But you do... Don't worry, Voxel. I'm on the hunt. What do I do? I don't know. Throw it at the butt. Cover your ears. Bye. Hey, you got anything to eat? I'm kind of hungry. Uh, I could keep an eye out. Mr. Hopsworth sometimes. He doesn't usually know that, though. Ah. Voxel's giant dog sounded a lot like the stalker that had taken Milo. Now I was sure that the stalker had entered the city. 
There had to be a way in through the main gates. So, can I use the firecracker on these guys? Why is this peeping? Firecracker. Use. Yeah, there we are. The smell of the mini K was highly pungent. Let's do the door ritual. Let's uh, hit the bumper. Right. I believe. Hit the bumper. Then uh, do a jig. These were not my best moves. <laughs> hit the bumper. Right. Hit the bumper. Mm. Pull the door. have one mini K. Should I give it to the kid? I don't know. Want some hot dogs, dude? A android finger. Anything you can tell me about this finger? Whoa. Okay, this is some serious kit. The micro actuators alone are worth a bundle. Want to trade? I think I'll hold on to it for now. Sure. Drink. Shame it ain't something stronger. Would you like to hear a knack verse joke? Sure. Not really. Uh. How do you make a sausage roll? Listen, I push it down an hill. <laughs> Seriously. The guy looked like he'd been out in the sun a bit too long. Smelled like it too. Hey, Wendell. Managed to get the. Just about. Did you uh, do the jig? Sure did. You said it was essential. That's right. Although his. But it always seems to. Up. Anyway, what can I do for you? Want one of these mini K's? Oh. Um, I thought you. Oh. Uh, oh. What? Don't get. Sorry. No. Oh, I see. Suit yourself. Be seeing you. Bye. Uh. Where is my technician guy? Oh, there you are. Some uh, mouse. Excuse problems. me. Well, hey there, stranger. How's you? Well, I. Great, I'll bet. And by the way, just so you know. Yes, of course, no problem. Do you need technical expertise to be a diagnostic? Of course. You need to know exactly where to point your. See, I come to work, and then I report the problem. My interventions are key to the smooth running of Union. Nice jacket. Oh, thanks. I like yours too. About this. Now, it makes me kind of uncomfortable. You know what I mean? 
This may sound like a stupid question. Well, first thing would be to head over to the city gate. Uh, yeah. If you got a valid ID, and just scan your YouTube. So, and the bridge will open. I'm gonna uh, valid for what? I need to get an ID. Now, that, you need a vehicle to get through the big. If you have from the from the girl, up, I believe. Scan your ID. And roll right up. It's really what? Because it kidnapped. Well, that. I know it sounds. Nah. Shift workbench had been set up. Its structural integrity seemed over reliant on some old deflated tires. Hmm. A makeshift workbench had been set up. Its structural integrity seemed over reliant on some old deflated tires. Excuse me. What is it? I'm talking to Vox here. Can I ask you something? Yeah, go on. So are you digging that guy's U chip out of it? What? No. Dad, I cloned his ID. What happens? Well, for a pro. <laughs> uh, yeah. I got a U chip with a temporary ID from over there. Good for you. They're free. Can I get into the city with it? No. And yes. And no. Make up your mind. Break that down for me. No, a temp ID is so they can keep track of you around here. Won't get you inside. Yes, I could deep that corpse's ID onto a U chip. And no, because as you well know, my deet's been eaten. Any idea whose body that was out there? Dunno. Just some guy from the city. How do you know? Because I got the citizen's ID from his U chip. Duh. I spoke to Voxel about his monster. You. I think his monster. Oh, won't be seeing him anytime soon. Nice one, Super. Vox. What? Pixel. Mate, I don't know you. Stop asking questions, finish your business, and move along. Meanwhile, where's Pixel? Me and him need to have some words about stranger danger. Stranger danger. Are you sure you haven't? Kind of hot? So, no. I haven't seen your kid. Any idea? You got one of them new chips? Yeah, just got one from the terminal over there. Ah, uh, that one's no good. They've given you a cheap temp ID so the droids don't run you over. Bridge only opens for citizens. So is mate. Catch you later. Peace. So yeah. Ember's deed had a citizen ID stored on it. Gonna continue a play beyond a seal sky. You can get it in the usual places. Just search for it. And I'm gonna call it a, a video, a let's play video thing. So, uh, yeah, stay tuned for your regular Friday video, if you will. What is this? Ah, again, mouse problems. There was something strange about the water. And there was an unmistakable. Am I gonna die? Ozone. Let's see if I can die. Close. I could see the water was holographically concealing an electric fence. Let's try and kill ourselves. There was an electric fence back there. I wondered if it was live. Ow. Yeah. I was shocked to discover that it was. Oh, nice. No wonder the gang gangs kept clear of this death trap. So yeah, as I was saying, if you enjoy this video, leave it a thumbs up, because uh, why not? If you didn't enjoy it, well, you can check out the others here on the channel. I have plenty more. Let's try to talk with Big Steve. One particularly large and familiar bird stood out from the rest. It's Big Steve. Bird's beak looked especially vicious. Take the tool. Come on, big fella.
Euh, ouais, à mon coup, ouais. Bird's beak looked especially vicious. Take the tool, goddammit. Hmm. Come on, big fella. Can I stun them at the wall? Oh yes. Yeah. Hope he didn't die. Pick that up, you freaking moron. Yeah, seriously? So again, uh, yeah, I found the tool. Uh, leave a thumbs up in the video if you like it. If you didn't like it, uh, leave it a thumbs up anyway. So uh, check out the other videos here on the channel. Remember, you can follow me on the various social media networks that exist. For some uh, social media nonsense while I'm uh, well just uh, making you run. Enjoy this little piece of happiness. And uh, as always, thank you very much for watching this uh, Let's Play video thing. If you enjoy adventure games, look for this one again in the usual places. It is the sequel to Beneath a uh, Steel Sky, one of the classics on the PC. One of the best adventure games, or the best not Sierra or LucasArts adventure games, so uh, check it out. As always, thank you very much for uh, watching what you just did, and uh, until my next video, uh, please do take care.